Hello guys and welcome to today's vlog. I just want to start by saying that I am focusing very much on driving. I'm just holding the vlog cam while I'm driving on the highway. So there's no gear shifting or anything. I'm focusing on the road so don't worry about that. It's a little after 6 in the morning and I've been driving for a while. I'm going to Gothenburg today. The reason that I'm going to Gothenburg is that today I'm working for a company that my friend works at. The assignment I have and what they've lent me in for is to update their fit bit monters. I don't think it's called monters, whatever, the, the place in the store where they sell their product. So I'm gonna go around to different stores in Gothenburg today and update those. And after that I'm going to a little place called Trollhättan to a storage unit and I'm gonna pick up some stuff that I need for the coming days. So that's what I'm doing today. Hello guys, the time is now 12.44, so a lot of the day has gone by, a lot of it has been driving and I've also done two stores where I've updated the things. I haven't been able to film a lot because it's quite stressful, I have a lot to do. I'll try bringing the camera in here and set it up so you can see what it looks like. See you inside. Hello again guys, I didn't show you the finished product because uh, I was kind of in a rush to go on with the day but maybe I can do that at the last stop just to show you how it looks when I'm done with it. I've done three stores now and I'm on my way to a place called Trollhättan which is about an hour from Gothenburg. In Trollhättan there is a storage unit that I said before and we're going there to pick up some stuff to be able to keep on upgrading the things. So we're about 20 kilometers away from Trollhättan right now. I'm also gonna pick up some other stuff there for my friend Marcus which I'm working for right now and then we're going back to Gothenburg to finish at one more store before we go home to Motala again. Also, if I'm gonna talk a little bit about the job that I do right now, it's uh, pretty fun. I enjoy doing it. I don't really mind going like long distances in the in the car because as long as I can listen to music, I'm fine. Even though it's many hours. Only thing that's kind of boring is that uh, you're alone. I guess I've never had a problem with being alone. But I mean, when you're in a work setting, it can be fun to have someone to work with so you can socialize a bit. Time goes a little bit faster when you're more than one person, I say. But it's fine, it's okay. It's gonna be a long day today, and I can't wait to get home to the family. By the way, have any of you guys listened to the new album yet? If so, what do you think? If you like it, then you can comment below and say what your favorite track is. Okay, so now we are on the way back to Gothenburg again, after picking up all the boxes that we were gonna pick up in the storage unit. Here is one box. There is a box yes. The whole car is actually filled with boxes right now, from top to top. So now we're just gonna make our way back to Gothenburg, and we're going to the part in Gothenburg called Partille, to a store called El Giganten, which means the electric giant. Look at this finger right here. I cut myself before. I have a kind of pliers to bite off stripes. I don't know what you call it in English, but the things that keep cords and stuff together. I need to cut them up so I can work with the cords. Apparently those pliers were sharp. I reached down my hand in the bag 
I cut myself kind of bad because it just instantly started spritzing blood. I had a towel to stop the worst bleeding with and I have, I have like three band-aids over it instead. As hard as they could have been put on because the bleeding would not stop. I am such a clumsy clumps. So now I'm walking out from the last store. I'm gonna start to head home. I should stop to get something to eat because otherwise I'll probably fall asleep. This electric store is ginormous. It's a big, big block of electricity store. And it's time for me to say goodbye to Gothenburg. If I have any viewers in Gothenburg, your city is nice. I like Gothenburg. But I like home even more, so let's head home to the family. There's another three hours behind the wheels, but then we'll be home. Slowly, slowly, we're going home. All we're looking for now is a Max hamburger restaurant. And when I find one, I'm gonna order a big, juicy menu. Mies are hungry. By the way, the car I'm driving is a Volvo V40, the company car of the guy I'm working for, who is also my friend, called Marcus. One of my childhood besties. Very fresh, very new, very clean, very nice to drive. What do you guys think about Volvos? Hello. So I decided to settle for Burger King because I'm really hungry right now. And I need food and coffee and drink. I like Burger King too, so. You see that burger up there on the wall? Called the Bacon King? What the hell is that? That sounds exciting. I thought I was the Bacon King. Hey, I would like to have a Bacon King menu. Cola, thank you. I would like to have six stycken nuggets. Cola menu? No. Yeah. Och vilken dipplåt vill du ha? Garlic. Ja, ta sex lökringar också. Ja, någonting mer. Kaffe också. Kaffe, liten eller mellan? Mellan blir bra. Vill du ha mjölk eller socker i? Nej. Var det bra också? Ja. 149 kronor, tack. Tack, tack. That's a menu for a champ. I'm not gonna eat here, but if I were, it's a pretty nice view here. There's a lot of forests and a little bit of mountains. It's a nice view from here. I don't know if you can see. I just drove past a place called Meat Hill. In Swedish that is Kjötkulla. That's a really funny name. The town or the place I need to go to to be able to make a left so I can go to Motown or Motala eventually. It's called Mjölby. Mjölby would translate to flower village as in flower that you make bread out of. Many Swedish cities would have quite dorky names if you translate them. So the sun is starting to set now and uh, before I'll be home it'll probably be dark. It was pitch black when I left home this morning and it will be pitch black when I come home. That defines a long day at work. When you go this Jön shopping way that I'm driving at now. Now you have the sunset going on over there and you have the water on your left side and you have like hillsides and mountains on your on your right. This whole landscape is so cool. If you want to drive through Sweden to get a good view of a pretty landscape, this is where you should drive. This is really pretty. I would not like to live here though because this is the highway. There's always big trucks driving here and stuff so I bet your house would vibrate a bit if you were living close to this. A lot of sounds at night and stuff wouldn't be so nice. We're home now. Let's see if Rascal and Caddis missed me. I wonder, I wonder if there's a puppy nearby. Oh, ho, ho, ho. there was a puppy. Oh my god, and he has sleepy ears. These ears are so sleepy. Watch, they are not on full mast. They are not on full mast. Never seen sleepier ears. Let me smell, let me smell. Yeah, you have been sleeping all right. This smells like a sleepy puppy, yeah? <laughs> oh, so sleepy, oh. If 
first thing you could find was not a toy, it was a bone. You just take anything that's nearby and bring. You're slacking, rascal. I thought we decided on toys. I don't want your stinky bone. Come on, your friend. Battery pack is running out. What do you have to say? Uh, uh, hello. Is that it? Yeah. That's all. Yeah. Well, in that case, I hope you have a fucking sound day.